a strong believer, and a lot of people are, that the YouTube life is a long journey, you know? And most of the time, you're gonna be by yourself. A lot of people, you know, they just come out with the content, ideas by themselves, and it's hard. But one of the hardest things is taking portraits or pictures by yourself. So today, guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys a little, like a little idea or a little how I do my stuff, how I do my pictures by myself. It's kind of easy, but at the same time, you have to be willing to uh, not be shy because you know these public places, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But yeah, so I'm showing you guys how to take my pictures today. God, damn, I'm very loud. As fucking shit, come on, man. But anyways, guys, um, welcome back to another episode. I'm glad you guys are back again. I'm in my car. Uh, my car is kind of my office, so. You guys are gonna see me a lot vlogging from my car. I ain't tripping. I don't mind vlogging from my car. It's cool. I feel comfortable. So yeah, man. Let's get this started. Get some B-roll, get some pictures. Let's get it, guys, for sure. All right, guys, I know I say this a lot, but this is my setup today. You know, we got the Canon 5D Mark IV with this amazing tripod that I got a I got on Amazon, so this is me. This is gonna be my photo setup today. All right, so I'm gonna be aiming the camera to the driving seat. Actually, you can see this right there, yep. So I'm gonna add some, uh, some details, you know, with the door and this part of the car. So the way I'm doing this is, uh, so the 5D has Wi-Fi connection, so I'm taking the picture with my phone. It works, so I'm, I'm happy, so yeah, so uh, I'm taking a like, Wi-Fi connection, so it's pretty dope. Let me show you guys the set again, like the setup I have right here. I'm gonna right there, you know, having some contrast with the door and this part of the car. So yeah, like, I like, I like the pictures, how it came out, you know, I took like four, like two, three, and complaining, so yeah, so uh, let me get some, a little bit more B-roll out here, so drones. And then we'll probably go to a second location. So, so let's get it guys, for sure. Nah, that's too much. Probably like six percent of YouTubers, including me, we procrastinate a lot, and we pretty much we run out of ideas daily. You know, I'm starting, so it's kind of hard for me to like come up with ideas, especially because you know I'm new to this world of YouTube. If you're already out there, you know, I feel like it'd be a little bit easier. You can record anything, and people are still gonna watch. So that's cool. Uh, but at the same time, it's like. Everybody goes through block of creativity, you know? And some people, you know, some people can really come out of it because, you know, like I said earlier, you know, like, YouTube is a really lonely, it's a lonely road, you know? Like, you hear by yourself, you go out, get content by yourself. So it's kind of hard. But at the same time, you know, and, it's, and a lot of people say it's the hardest job ever. So, man, I, 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 I understand that and I, and I believe it is, you know? You have to please people. You have to make, you have to come up with ideas to keep people, you know, interested and laughing, etc., etc., And so they can keep watching you, but at the same time, you know, it's hard. And as a creator, you know, the best thing we can do is just keep creating. You know, I know I don't, I know I don't post a lot, but hey man, I'm trying, all right? So, but yeah, man, uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying this vlog. I'm about to get to a second location in a minute. So yeah, guys, let's get it. All right, guys, so for this shot, it's gonna be a random one. I'm just inside the car. Uh, I got the camera, got the camera right there. And I'm taking pictures like if I'm working or something, you know, but. um. So yeah, so this is gonna be a random. Not bad, there you go, the light. And you, yeah, so this is gonna be a random shot. I feel like this is gonna be the last location or the last shot I, uh, I take. But yeah, guys, uh, 
I'm gonna take you guys back to uh, to my computer, see some uh, some editing settings I've been doing. I'm gonna teach you guys how to do my edits, what I do, what I post, the quality, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So let's get it, guys, for show. Sure. All right, guys. So uh, welcome to a little editing session. So we are here, right? This is the the shot guy inside the car. So the first thing I would do, I would remove the chronic uh, aberration and enable lens correction. As you see, we do that again. Boom, boom, right? Perfect. Let's crop it to Instagram format with four by five. I'm doing this kind of quick, so I'm gonna do quick one. That little bit right there, boom. We gotta go to light. And then right here, so the first thing, exposure. I don't touch anything with this. You know, I don't like putting a lot of exposure on my photos. So, contrast. I like my picture a little dark. The blacks, you know, so they can pop up. That about seven looks good. And then, highlights. Sometimes I like my <clears throat> my background, you know, to be a little bit light. I think 3C will look good. Yep, yep, let me see, check that out real quick. Yep, that looks good. My shadows. Uh, there's times that I like my shadows to like really pop out because you know sometimes I have the shirt on, the computer. I think 75 will look good. Let me see. Mm-hmm. Good right there. Yep, like that. Whites, I really like sometimes, you know, you can see it highlights my face a little bit. So let's put some whites on. 19, there you go. Boom, let's see that. Before, after. That looks good. The black, so we can get, you know, the shirt to pop up a little bit. Drop it down. Turn it around. A looks good. Boom, there you go. Nice. I like that. Boom, I like that. Yep. Um next we can fix some colors so let's put some temperature on let's put some warm and that looks good around there because we still gotta fix some uh, some color mixes i don't really touch my backgrounds a lot i don't i don't be doing i don't be touching that a lot so i'm gonna just skip that saturation let's drop it down a little bit probably around 10 11 looks good yep and then this is where i spend most of my time while well, edit I go one by one, depending on how the picture looks. There's not a lot of red, so we're gonna skip that one. I guess let's fix some oranges. Saturation, let's drop it a little bit. Let's see, lemon looks good. Then luminance will bump it up so you can brighten my face a little bit. I think around 35, 36 look good. Some yellow. Saturation, let's bump it up to like, let me see, bump it up to like around two, three. I think two will be fine. And then luminance, let me see, bright my face a little bit. I think around two, three, two. I think that was good right there. Yep, yep. There's no green, so we're gonna skip that one. So, um, for right here, this is actually like just affects, if you can see right here, this area, let me see how it affects the blue a little bit. So I'm gonna touch it a little bit, put like 30, a little bit more black and gray in the back. You see right here, that looks good. Some blues, the blues actually affect the, the blacks a lot. So what we can do is right here, drop it up to 30, 31, 30, that looks good. And then this, I think, that's, I think that looks good for me, guys. I'm doing this a little bit quick, but I think that's good for me. Okay guys, so for effects, I don't add, I don't add a lot of textures. Well, I never do, so I'm gonna leave that on zero. For clarity, I really like my clarity a little bit, a little high. Not like this, but you know, a little bit. Skip on the 15. I think 12 will look fine. Yeah, I like how it looks. For D haze, I was like a little bit. We can leave it um, leave it at 13. I think that looks good right there. Yep. Let's add some things yet. So match, you know, with blacks. My, and my clothes so let's drop a little bit i think 10 looks good right there check that out real quick i've i've always had some grain on my photos i just like how it looks it adds a little bit of a uh, more realistic feel in my opinion i always skip it between 18 and 28 so let's put on keep it 25 today 
Yep, I like that. So let's fix some stuff right here. Fix my face, have some little hair and shit, but hey man. It's cool. Uh, I think that looks good. Pop it out. There you go, guys. I like how this picture came out. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the little editing session. Thank you guys for staying this long in the video. More of this will be com coming out soon. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, you already know. And I'll see you guys on the next vlog. Whew.